Bro, and thank you for coming here to Gotham City again so soon. Um, we at the law firm of How Doing Screwem apologize for having to have this press conference so soon after the last one, but due to recent events, we felt that it was necessary. Um, although we are all sad about the death of Harvey Dent, um, he was one of us, a lawyer, and uh, we believe, though, that the best way to remember him is not to mourn him, but to continue our pursuit against the villain known as the Batman. Uh, the Batman is still at large, and we were right in our original assessment of him. Uh, recently, he killed five people along with Dent, and we will we believe that he may have been involved in more of the murders. Uh, we believe that he may have been working with the Joker. Uh, they seem to have, from what we've been able to see, that he, they have some sort of connection together, like how they fit each other, like two sides of a coin. Uh, we're not sure if they're working together, but we will be pursuing investigating that, and hopefully we'll be able to find the Batman for more crimes that he has committed. Uh, we will be continuing our class action lawsuit against the Batman over the Phil Hartman monorail destruction, and we're sure that Den and Phil Hartman will be glad at what we are doing. And we will be helping, uh, offering help and support to all the families hurt in the recent Batman incidents uh, and the Joker incidents. Um, now I'll open the floor up to questions. Um, yes, you, uh, Peter David of CBG. Yes, um, the Chinese account Lao. Um, yes, we believe that the Batman was involved in him coming back to America. We believe that he illegally, Batman, illegally entered China and kidnapped a citizen. Um, I don't think I need to tell you how illegal that is. Uh, we're working with our Hong Kong branch to see if it's an international, we believe it's an international crime, and hopefully we can have the Batman tried in not just Gotham's courts and not just the st our state of Illinois' courts but along with China's courts. And, uh, yes, um, we will be working on that. And also, um, I like your column, and Kung Lush, I wish you the best of luck in your uh, quest. Um, yes, uh, Mike Engel, yes. If, oh, I'm glad to see you again back from, uh, yeah, it's been a rough few weeks for the both of us, for both our companies. My law firm and yours, <laughs> Gotham Cable News, we've... <sighs> Yeah. I uh, guess, uh, your question. Yeah, I was expecting that. Um, yes, we are very upset about the Joker trying to kill one of our lawyers, and along with you and your associates. Uh, and we are offering our support to you, as you know. Uh, we're already working with, uh, GCN, and we'll continue working with you. You're a fine comp uh, you're a fine news corporation. We'll continue to work with you. And um, we won't be filing an action against the Joker, or we won't be supporting him, either one. Uh, we believe that, given how poorly Gotham City Police have done, that the Joker is probably just going to break out of jail again, and it doesn't matter. Because, honestly, this is some of the worst police work I have ever seen, and it's just a disgrace. Uh, we're thinking of filing a suit against the cops for doing such a horrible job at their job. Um, yeah, so, like, even with the Joker, like, I mean, we're filming inside of offices. Like, normally we'd be outside on a court filming this, but we're stuck inside because we're afraid of the Batman and the Joker. Um, yes, another question. Uh, you, um, John Ostrander of Comic Mix, yes. Um, uh, yes, uh, we will be defending Maroney and his as business associates. Uh, we don't believe they've been doing anything wrong, and we believe that the lawsuit against them is unfair, we're going to try to throw it out of court. Um, we believe that that case should be wrapped up in a year, year and a half. Um, Maroney should suffer no problems, although the smaller, his smaller associates being unable to conduct business for a year and a half may go bankrupt, uh, which is a terrible thing. Uh, another question, yes, you, um, oh, not you again, oh, Lois Lane, you put on glasses and me. Oh. No, I will not answer any more of your questions. I'm really just sick of this. I'm not going to talk about the supposed Penguin Crime Lord or this Edward Noshton Enigma person who wrote the letter to the Gotham Times. I will not be discussing it, and frankly, I'm sick of you 
coming to our press conferences and hounding us. Really, just go back to President Luther and hound his press secretaries, why don't you? Oh, and by the way, we, our law firm in Metropolis will be filing up a suit against Superman. I mean, really, landing an airplane in a baseball field? That is not safe. This press conference is over.